Now, molecular cloud is sort of the neighborhood where these planets and stars form together. You can think of a whole neighborhood is molecular cloud, and then each star and planet would be like a house on each block. It's sort of a not a very densely populated neighborhood, so you might have the whole city block to yourself. Orion started out as a giant molecular cloud with smog sized particles and a lot of gas. And as the time went on, it fragmented into smaller regions which over time also fragment. As this big cloud starts shrinking, it will start rotating faster. The grains and the gas will start concentrating themselves in the center. Once they get to a certain size, the cloud will start collapsing on itself because gravity is pulling it in. So then you have more pressure, more heat. Once it reaches a certain temperature, fusion will ignite. And now we have a young star forming with a disk around it. A lot of that dirt will eventually be funneled down through the disk onto the protostar. So that's how the protostar will eventually gain its mass and become massive enough to turn on. 